After meeting up in April, the two Mars explorers parted ways, leading to a loss of signal between them. Here's what happened after Perseverance finally drove back into communication range with Ingenuity on this episode of Mars Guy. The saga of the incredibly successful and long operating Mars helicopter has been full of literal twist turns and cliffhangers. We last saw our hero Ingenuity on April 16th in a remarkably close-up view made possible after Perseverance drove within about 23 meters. See episode 107. Here's Mars Guy for scale. Two Martian sols later, a little over two Earth days, Perseverance drove off to explore the edge of Belva Crater. Ingenuity didn't just sit around, though. It flew off on its 51st flight on April 22nd, shooting some images for the science team and then heading west in the direction of the long-term science target for Perseverance. Its pre-planned landing spot placed it on the other side of a rocky ridge from the work zone of Perseverance. In my original telling of the story in episode 112, it appeared that this location led to the subsequent radio silence between the two, thanks to a terrain-related communications shadow. But a twist in the story was revealed this past week. Perseverance was finally ready to move again after struggling for weeks to collect a core sample of crumbly but scientifically compelling sedimentary rock and dealing with a fault-induced safe mode, see previous episode. After getting past some challenging terrain, it drove in a southerly direction that appeared to be heading toward Ingenuity. A second drive two saws later veered a bit more westerly, seemingly away from an intercept with Ingenuity. But to quote David Byrne, here comes the twister. Turns out that Ingenuity is not actually there. It had already flown away, way back on April 26th. We just didn't know the outcome until this week. Flight 52 had already been planned for this very date. Apparently there was still a radio link between Perseverance and Ingenuity at that time from this location, which in hindsight explains why there were some images downlinked from Flight 51 on April 22nd. It was Flight 52 that actually ended communications between the two, as anticipated by the engineers. After 63 days, contact was reestablished when Perseverance crested the ridge that had blocked the radial link with Ingenuity. It sent back 10 images from its nav cam, which were then relayed back to Earth, showing a successful landing within meters of its planned 363-meter flight due west of the previous location. Thanks to the distinctive shapes of the fractures in this terrain, the new location of Ingenuity can be accurately identified in the orbital view. This puts it about 500 meters away from the carbonate-rich terrain that's the next major science target of the mission. Perseverance is still more than 300 meters away from Ingenuity, too far to be seen by its engineering cameras, and there's not yet any high-res images posted. Still, we now know Ingenuity is still alive and apparently healthy, with plans for additional health checks to establish whether it's ready to return to flight. But after spending two months on its own, quietly waiting for the planned return of Perseverance, Ingenuity has proven that it doesn't need to be rescued, it just needs to be heard. 